anime con. What's up, YouTube? Square the Aftermath. Check it out. We are at the Anime Expo here in Los Angeles, California. Well, I don't want to say Los Angeles, New York. But anyways, we're going to experience this first time excitement right here, right now. Registration assistance badge pickup. All right, so we got to go right here. I got to pick up my badge. I had to buy a badge, actually. But I want to see if I can get a media badge as well. Oh, shit, that hurts. As well. While we do this, so I'm going to come here for... Friday, which is today, and then Saturday, which is tomorrow. Hopefully, I can get Jeff and stuff, the media team, and um, enjoy what's going on. So, I really need to head inside. Uh, it's like 110 degrees out here. My, my camera is hot as hell, and uh, so I'm just gonna just show you some nice stuff today, give you some excitement. That's pretty much it. Jack's Blades here. Hey, how's it going? Stay yeah. cool. Stay cool. We are on. And don't forget, moment time. Power of youth! Spraying sweat is the glory of youth. So all you break a sweat in the fun way. Because we're cosplayers, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, everybody. Pippi Longstocking or Wendy's? Comment below what you think. Alright? The <laughs> field is a number six. Before only when the triple hits. It's got the team time chopping ligaments. Oh, can we flip it? Hundred mega sex. For you to make it racks. Two rolling shots. Captain has drawn and we cut it. Samurai dance to we flip it. Hundred mega sex. For you to make it racks. Two rolling shots. Captain has drawn and we cut it. Samurai dance to we. Cloud Some rubies right here. Oh, check it. This is where you buy the goods, people. Yeah, one, I got one, two, three. That, uh, this, nunchucks, planjana. This is three hundred dollars, y'all. I'm gonna do some research on it tonight. And I might come back for it tomorrow. All right, look, I can't handle more of today. It's too hot. Hopefully, I can get my big guy in tomorrow. Come dress, walk around, and you know, do something that way. But right now, bro, we're gonna call it a day and uh, check for day two. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. Oh, all right, we got some G Fuel energy crystals. I guess they pop in your mouth because they're like pops. Edible, as in no water required at all. Energy that pops, ladies and gentlemen. And these are the energy crystals right here. I'm feeling some sour cherry right now. Like, how much do you take though? You just. Sour. Joseph, show you guys how we are the best company. 
around point blank. Might not have the most popular YouTubers posted up. But our shit's legit. That's yeah, a lot of stuff. Damn, what's this? What's this? Let's see, let's check out this white real quick. XL, white T. I think it might go. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. I like that little addition down there. Epic. What's this? Oh, new Alpha Tees. These look like they're a lot lighter. I'm probably about to throw this joint on. Yeah. These are the same thing. New gray. New brown. You too, Jeff. Also, let's, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's talk about the word Alpha. Alpha. A-L. Fu. Everybody, check this out. Being alpha is not being meathead ass, biggest bodybuilder ass mofo, all right? Being alpha is meaning you take care of your shit. You feel me? Being person of his word and doing what's right, all right? It ain't about cars and money and muscle. You feel me? Handle your business. That's what being alpha is, you feel me? Don't keep saying you feel me until everybody in the choir understands what I'm saying. The joggers, the alpha joggers, gray. Let's see what we got. We got all oh, these are oh, these are shorts. Alpha shorts. Boom joggers. This is my favorite color from Alpha. And uh, y'all see the rest of me wearing this. Right. Let's go work out. Yeah, that's a lot of shit. Ready? What's up YouTube, back with J-Dub with another epic video with your man Joseph. All right, IFBB Pro right here. Hey, bloody look at me right now. I'm right here, I'm talking, I'm talking. You're looking at my face right now. Check this out, we're about to hit some weight training with the chest. What, Joseph, what are we doing today, mate? We are here with chest today, and if you saw our last video uh, that I did with Tron, we did a lot of reps. So we're basically doing the same. We're pyramid building up, and then we're dropping all the way down doing burnout. So we're gonna feel it. Especially because we're able to push each other, we're really gonna feel it. Really. And you know, I'm not down with that, man. I'm not cool with that. It's like, I'm just gonna do what I can today. 2015, Ben 10, Ben 10. 25 reps, baby. This guy's insane. It's fucking crazy. But you know what? It's been a week since we've trained together. I feel like I can do this again, mate, you know? So, let's get it. See some chest hairs on them. Got a little bit of taco meat, you know? <laughs> I'm super lazy. It's 115 degrees outside. Um, bro, it's just days like this where you just gotta come in. I really do your thing, you know? Man's got shorts on, but it doesn't make sense because he has tights on under that as well. His balls are probably saltier than bikini bottom right now. You gotta be hot, mate, because no, these are cool. They just keep you cool. They, they look cool, but they're not cool. No, they keep you cool. But they're not. Was it Nike? Yeah. It's definitely not. I meant to be. <laughs> range of motion. Like, what do you look for? Um, are you like a boss or going all the way to lock out? I don't have to lock walk out yeah. all the way. Um, especially with like the amount of reps we're doing. We're going high repetition, so I don't know. Like I I don't feel like you have to lock out all the way. That's also another way you can create injury too. And at the same time too, when you're I'm going majority of the way up close to locking out. Yeah. So I still think that's just as challenging as locking out all the way. You're stopping yourself mid-motion and then coming back down, stopping, going back up, going motion, stopping, so. And as far as coming down, I just don't, 90 degrees. I don't over, uh, uh, do, all do the way down, like yeah. yeah. But 90 degrees, about that, you know. I'll tell everybody, like 90 degrees, mate, I mean, like, bro, 90 degrees is all you need, you know? You know, I, I understand the people out there, the trolls, or whatever, that's, you know, all the way down, stretch your chest out, make your elbows touch the floor. Yeah. And you know, press all the way up until whatever, mate. Look. Yeah. Bro, tell me Joe doesn't look like Shang Tsung. <laughs> you have a lot more muscular endurance than you think you have. Like you said, you're just a little lazy. You're just lazy, bro. Yeah, you're just lazy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
that. You see him? Just calling me out like that, bro. Calling me lazy. Bro, it's because I'm black, bro. My bro Zach from DOA was the first person ever to do the dab. He didn't know. I don't want to get like too buff today, you know? I gotta fit my outfit for tomorrow. I'm trying to be like... I'm not feeling it, this is too easy. You know, what's funny bro, I feel it the most when I don't go all the way down. You know? Like when I go all the way down, I don't feel it anymore. It's like, but when I start from like 90, I feel it more in my chest. Take my shield. Hurry up. Bro, what are you doing? You take the small ones before the big ones.
feel that. That's huge. Can you just get it right now? Yeah. Six. Seven. Eight. Easy, like you said. <laughs> no, nah, I need to chill out. I don't want to. Yeah, I've never torn and I don't ever want to. Two minor tears in both my pecs, leading up to last year's Olympia, too. And so my chest was small. Yeah, it was bad. I tore my shoulder at Olympia. Oh. It took like two years to recover, like a year and a half, something like that, yeah. Alright y'all, honestly, I don't that's not even like everything we probably would have done. We wouldn't have done more, yeah. yeah we would have done more. Yeah. I'm gonna stop because it's tight right here. Like I feel a big knot right here all of a sudden and I don't wanna make that worse. So word to the wise, understand when to stop. <laughs> because you said you torn like yeah, both your pecs. Yeah, I tore both my pecs, it sucks. So just listen to your body. So if you feel something. Make sure you take care of it. Don't push, don't think you're being tough and just push through something when you know it's gonna make you, make it worse eventually. So, longevity, Please. longevity. Do not, do not push past injuries. There is no such thing as getting better, better pushing an injury for a fact. All right, recovery is always key. So I'm gonna like, I'm not gonna not push, I'm going to not push myself right now and uh, just, just call it a day. You're not done, you're gonna keep going, yeah? I got a few workouts left. Yeah. I got a so, few. I'm, I'm, the, I'm the bitch today. But we need to get a leg day in. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. I don't know who you are. I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you. My name is Jeff.